The Arctic, a frozen frontier, is becoming one of the most contested regions on Earth. But what does this have to do with the space community? More than you might think. The Arctic plays a vital role in the operations of satellites, especially those in polar orbits. These orbits are critical for global coverage, powering GPS, communications, and climate monitoring systems. As the Arctic becomes more accessible due to melting ice, nations are racing to build infrastructure, including ground stations for satellites. This makes the Arctic a strategic region for space operations. The Arctic is warming nearly four times faster than the global average. Satellites are crucial for monitoring this rapid change, tracking ice loss, sea level rise, and greenhouse gas emissions, but geopolitical tensions could threaten the sharing of this vital data. The Arctic is also rich in resources like rare earth metals, materials essential for building satellites and rockets. Disputes over these resources could directly affect space technology supply chains. Then there's the issue of security. Nations are expanding their Arctic military presence, including space-based technologies for navigation, communication, and defense. The Arctic is becoming a new arena for global competition that could spill into space. The disputes over Arctic territories mirror the challenges of space governance. How we handle Arctic geopolitics could set a precedent for managing resources and territories in space. The Arctic and space, two seemingly different frontiers, are deeply connected. For the space community, staying engaged in Arctic geopolitics isn't optional. It's essential for ensuring peaceful exploration and global collaboration. What do you think? Should space agencies play a role in Arctic geopolitics?